रहीम असल ये लेसन 54 है अबाउट टोफल सीरीज फॉर द बिगनर्स आज हम लेसन में कॉजिटिव वर्ब्स को इन डेप्थ स्टडी करेंगे सो विदाउट फर्द यू लेट स्टार्ट द लेसन सो कॉजिटिव वर्ब्स आर बेसिकली यूज्ड टू इंडिकेट दैट वन पर्सन कॉजेज अ सेकेंड पर्सन टू डू समथिंग फॉर द फर्स्ट पर्सन इफ देर टू पीपल इन इन अ सेंटेंस दैन अ फर्स्ट पर्सन कॉज सेकेंड पर्सन टू डू गेट समथिंग डन फॉर द फर्स्ट वन सो इसमें हम जो वर्ब्स इस्तेमाल करते हैं टू गेट द सर्विस शोन दैट आर डन Uh, this is uh, used by this is shown by actually causative verbs now one can cause somebody to do something for him or her either by paying by asking or forcing the person so in either of the these three forms you may you ask um, you get the services done for yourself for the first person from the second one or causative verbs me ko hamare paas jo hum istemal karte hain to get those actions done unme hamare paas hai have get and make <coughs> अब हम इनको इन डेप्थ स्टडी करेंगे स्टार्टिंग ऑफ विद हैव एंड गेट सो दी क्लॉज इज द क्लॉज फॉलोइंग हैव और गेट मे बी एक्टिव और पैसिव सो आपके पास हैव और गेट के बाद का जो सेंटेंस uh, स्ट्रक्चर होगा जैसे हम क्लॉज भी कहते हैं उसमें वो एक्टिव फॉर्म भी हो सकता है और वो पैसिव फॉर्म भी हो सकता है सो लेट स्टार्ट द लुकिंग एट दोज रूल्स फर्स्ट फर्स्ट आपके पास ये है कि अगर हैव के बाद एक्टिव फॉर्म हो तो क्या तरीका होगा uh, आपके पास सेंटेंस स्ट्रक्चर विल बी सब्जेक्ट followed by have and have can be in any tense it can be past tense had or continuous tense having so regarding uh, regardless jo bhi aapki tense hogi have ki this will be followed by a complement and that usually will be a person and this will be followed by a verb in the simple form so agar aapke paas have ke baad active uh, sentence ka clause hai active clause hai to that will be the sentence structure ki aapke paas have ki maujoodgi mein verb in the simple form use hoga ab hum isko sentence ko structure dekh lete hain mary had john wash the car This is the active clause where had uh, followed by a simple verb form, or um, that's how you will infer that John washed the car um, for the Mary. Second, आपके पास ये है कि अगर आपके पास get मौजूद हो और आपने is that that um, sent clause is followed by an active clause, तो आप किस तरीके से sentence construct करेंगे? So there will be subject followed by get, and again it will be any tense regarding uh, its whether it's past or continuous. or present for that matter this will be followed by a complement which again will be usually a person and that will be followed by a verb in the infinitive form isse pehle jab humne have ki baat ki thi to wahan pe verb simple form mein tha but in case you are using the word get as a causative verb to aapke paas jo um, jo verb hoga uh, that will be in the infinitive form hum iske example dekh lete hain mary got john to wash the car again it's the same example we studied when it comes to get but uh, have but here when you are using the word the causative verb get to aap aise mein verb ko iski infinitive form mein istemal karenge इन केस इट्स अबाउट द पैसिव टेंस और आपके पास गेट या हैव है तो आपके पास सिंपल सेंटेंस स्ट्रक्चर कंस्ट्रक्शन ये होगी कि सब्जेक्ट फॉलोड बाई एनी टेंस दैट विल फॉलोड बाई कॉम्प्लीमेंट विच यूजली इज अ पर्सन एंड देन वर्ब इन द पास्ट पार्टिसिपल विल बी हेयर सो हम इसकी एग्जाम्पल देख लेते हैं इफ इन केस इट्स अ गेट सो मेरी गॉट द कार वॉश्ड सो द कार वॉज वॉश्ड बाय समबडी फॉर मेरी सो दैट सर्विस इज वॉट गिवन टू मेरी बाय सम वन सो दिस विल बी अ पैसिव टेंस or in case you are using the word have then the sentence construction is like mary had the car washed to so, isme aapke paas jo following verb hai that will be past participle regardless aap get use kar rahe hain ya aap have use kar rahe hain these are the some examples when it comes to an active clause followed by either have or um, get so hum isko start karte hain the first example is the president had his advisors arrange a press conference again had followed by a simple verb form second example is george is getting his teachers to give him a makeup exam so again regardless of get ki koi bhi uh, tense form hai the following aapke clause mein jo verb hai that is in the infinitive form third example is mary has had a friend type all her all of her type papers so the had is followed by a simple verb form example 4 is john is having his father contact the officials so the word having uh, have is in the continuous form here which we I spoke before ki kisi bhi tense form mein hoga and that followed by a simple verb form regardless um furthermore the editor had the contributors attend a composition workshop so the word had followed by a simple verb form and then final morris got his job got his dog to bring him the newspaper so again got is followed by a simple verb um, infinitive verb form all when it comes to an active clauses
अब हम एग्जाम्पल देखते हैं पैसिव क्लासेस की इन केस यू आर वर्किंग देर यू हैव वर्क पॉजिटिव सेंटेंसेज टू कंस्ट्रक्ट सो फॉर एग्जाम्पल इज James has his shirts cleaned at the dry cleaner. So this is the uh, verb in the past participle form, and this is your causative verb. Second example is Pat is having her car repaired this week. Anna got her paper typed by her friend. Again, these are all past participles. The president is having a press conference arranged by his advisers. Rick was having his hair cut when John called. Mary got her husband arrested. Exception: A person is the complement, but the second clause is uh, is passive. So it's just um have to have show give you the clarity. कि जिस किस तरह से आप have और get को active tense या passive tense में passive voice में इस्तेमाल करेंगे. So I hope this all makes sense. If it did, subscribe to my channel, like and share, and I'm sure आप इसको और भी go through करेंगे. Thanks for watching this video.